Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Dr. Subhav Ramnani, an intern doctor in Delhi after graduating from medical school abroad in Armenia. And today I will be sharing the parts of my journey that I feel have changed me as a person. So I spent the most prime years of my life from 18 years to 24 years away from home. I mean, away from my home in India. And I basically grew up from a teenager to an adult but all this 3,000 kilometers away in a foreign land, which I call my second home, which is Armenia. My time in a foreign country away from home gave me some life lessons that has shaped me over a span of these six years. So I think I can give you a very concise list of how this has helped me and changed my personality and made me who I am today. So here's a list of things that I have learned while staying and studying abroad. So before beginning today's video, let me tell you in the last FMG attempt, which was June 2022, only 10% people passed as per the statistics. And this is very concerning. And that's why an academy has come up with this new plan only for FMGs, which will have live classes and you will have live study schedule. So you don't need to, you know, waste time on one subject and then in the end cram all the subjects. You'll have a live study schedule and you'll follow that. It will consist of previous year question papers, your doubt clearing sessions, high yield topics and everything else. So all this is included in one package. And if you want to start with these live classes, which are starting on Monday, which is the 11th of July, do subscribe to an academy right now and use my code SUBHAV10 to avail an exclusive 10% discount. And let's get to the video. Number one, personal development. The most important stranger you will get to know while living abroad is yourself. At first, being away from home is overwhelming. You can't do so many things that you, that you know come up very easily and without even thinking when you're back home. You are your own caretaker abroad. You have no one basically but yourself. But you know what they say, you grow through what you go through. So this journey abroad allowed me to explore different sides of me, like being, a, being independent from being a pampered kid back at home in India. I learned how to cook. I learned how to clean. I learned how to maintain a house, which I believe is very important as you grow up, because trust me before, you know, when I was living in India, I did not know any of these things. And I have no shame in admitting that I did not know how to cook or do like basic stuff which you have to do to run a house and there because I was alone I had to do everything and through this process I learned and I take full pride that I've learned this now so this transition wasn't a smooth road you know I learned things over the years and it was not like I took a magic pill and you know I learned everything so like managing household chores and studies together, you know, sharing a space with a roommate, uh, learning about budgeting and savings, uh, handling everything alone, the ups and the downs and the rough patches, everything alone. Being away helped me in a way. Mentally, I became more stronger, I guess, because in a way I knew I have no backup and I have to handle things on my own. So I guess this gave me a confidence and it built my self-confidence because as and when I was doing these new things for the first time uh, it you know uh, gave me a sense of belief that I can do this and this is not that difficult I can live alone I can cook alone I can you know manage myself a whole house alone as well as doing my studies in medical school and having a social life and having some mental peace so it was not a smooth journey but it was a very well crafted journey i would say and i learned a lot uh, in this towards the end which has shaped my personality so it put me through you know real life tests and i'm sure the solutions are different from the textbooks uh, it was a very practical way uh, i learned these things uh, rather than you know uh, learning it as you go I just learned it because I had to do it you know uh, I had no other option 
so in a way it helped me develop my personality and i learned so many things so being uh, being abroad also taught me the importance of balance between having a personal life having a social life and having an academic life so i was able to finish my medical degree explore the place make new friends and manage everything etc and etc all because i was living alone abroad and i'm sure some of these things wouldn't have been possible had i been staying at home in india so you meet so many different people for you know so many different backgrounds and cultures and these people eventually become your your close circle and eventually become your family so in this long run i also met strangers that have become my family right now and we share a very tight bond so i think this is a huge step as a young guy and now i come up you know as an evolved and changed person with a lot of experience in hand and not just a medical degree but with a lot of experience which i have learned living alone abroad in a different country number 2 there is cultural diversification i love traveling and that's pretty evident i have some you know travel vlogs even though this is not a travel channel but you, if you want you can check them out right here and i'll also link them in the description box below so anyway i love traveling and the best part about travel is knowing more about the culture of that place and enjoying what the local people do there i got to see many amazing things in my time in armenia like you know there are uh, drinking fountains everywhere around the country which has you know pure clean water and it's available for free and you know people just go and drink from there and we don't have something like this in india so this was like a very new thing for me and i would love that every country should you know have clean free drinking you know safe water everywhere around the city available uh, for free basically the diversification culture shock you get shapes you up as a person i would say because you tend to be like the people around you Uh, what they do you tend to you know uh, pick up on their habits so i learned about armenia its people its history its food and its culture i met people in this journey as i said who have now become my family we share a very tight bond and it's very nice to watch the lives of these people just like us but with a little bit of uniqueness so i get a different perspective of the lives of other people got introduced to their traditions their food and clothes and now i carry this along with me and i follow some of that aspects even now here in my life i still miss some of the amazing food uh, some of the amazing dishes i had in it, uh, while i was in armenia i developed some great habits in armenia which i still follow so uh, the people around you the culture shock also helps you and develops you as a person i feel and it has definitely developed me so one more thing this culture shock also came up with me learning a new language so i even learned a new language and if you are going to living in a place for a long period of time it's always great to learn their language because it you know it removes the communication barrier and i definitely believe in this quote i guess by rita may brown uh, that the language is the road map of a culture it tells you where its people come from and where they are going what i found most amazing was that how adapting or blending more cultures gives a new shape to your personality and you are dwelled with the most beautiful memories number 3 an explorer i love adventure and being here in armenia or being there in armenia for this very long time allowed me to explore the most beautiful parts of the city uh, of the country and also different cities and i believe that i am extremely extremely lucky and grateful to have experienced all of this which would have not maybe you know maybe possible otherwise i maybe would have never come across armenia had i not been you know studying there so uh, studying abroad gave me a chance to look at a new country uh, maybe i would not have traveled you know in my whole entire life so and also like fun fact the world's longest cable car is in armenia and it's awesome and i went there so yeah studying abroad made me do this and like you know made me go to the world's longest cable car which is in armenia so yeah 
all these three points has shaped me and my personality and how i am today i went in as a young boy and i came out as a man and in the end i'm glad to say that i filled my life with adventures and that way i have great stories to tell up tell about my ups and downs and how i managed everything living abroad so i think that's about it and if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you are studying abroad tell me what you have learned studying abroad you know uh, apart from studying medicine or whatever course you're doing you must have learned something new which you would not have learned had you been staying at the comfort of your home here uh, in india or wherever you stay so anyway till until then see you in the next video stay safe stay happy and stay mad but just about medicine